I'm so sick of having I was shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's only vaguely insulting. Look, you sound just like Julius Little. Putting a guy who betrayed you in the number two slot seems like a great way to get killed. I'm nothing like Julius. Kinsey, we're ready. I'm sending Sid the jailbreak. Any last advice? When you're inside Matt's virtual oubliette, there's a decent chance that I'll be focusing on interfacing with the intrusion countermeasures, so pay attention to the console commands. Any last advice I'll understand? Don't get killed. Gotcha. The self-proclaimed hacker god ran all the cyber terrorism for the syndicate back in Steelport. Now he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. I just hope we can trust him like she does. No gun? You're putting a lot of faith in my winning personality. Well, you don't have superpowers either. I don't think a bunch of words blocking the screen is going to help me, Kinsey. It's a command prompt. Just give me a second. Mered. Damn it! The camera screwed up. <sighs> you just have to deal with it. Yeah, yeah, Rachel Sheik. I get it. I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. Oops, sorry. Fever slipped. This never stops being fun. That's better. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. This is the usual wanton destruction part, yes? Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. I must say, I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> uh, it was really more like three times. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. Yeah, the only person beyond help is you, Zinyak. <sighs> Very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. Marching in.
Destroying the tower should destroy the tents with it. Miss Kensington is rather astute for a human. Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Ugh. Touche. I almost forgot. Kinsey, I forgive you. For what? For not singing with me earlier. God, are you still mad about that? I said I was sorry. You want to truly apologize? You sing Pala Abdul at karaoke night. I don't think it should be that easy for you. He's made the tower invulnerable. Hang on, I'll find a workaround. Again, I am impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the Zin, my dear. Tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. To the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays have lighted fools the way to dusty death. Oh. Out, brief candle. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage. And then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot. Full of sound and fury. Signifying... Sorry, I don't really follow American hip-hop. It's a quote from Macbeth. Sorry, I don't really follow Scottish hip-hop.
They're coming up on Matt's prison. Hold on. How do I break Matthew out without a weapon? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. He'll just have to wing it. You can't even give me a hint? Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. Of course. Why would I need a hacker in a virtual prison? Guess que say? Before you, I place a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live on borrowed time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you will willingly submit yourself to execution. This is the moment where you can prove to be the savior of humanity, or its absolute destroyer. What is this place? This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes, and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. The evidence is irrefutable. 